Hey Willa, it's your dad and Jade here to wish you a happy 13th birthday. Can you believe it? 13 years old. Um, I just wanted to wish you a happy birthday, honey pie. And I want you to know how special you are to all of us. I can't believe 13 years old, it's happened so fast. I just clearly remember when you came into the world, how happy your mom and I were. We totally cried and it's so easy to remember the morning that you came in, how we were rushing around to get to the hospital, make sure you'd be okay. And you came out so quickly. And since that time, you've been such a joy for mom and I, and we're so incredibly grateful to have you. Um, Aiden is so lucky to have you as a sister. You've just been so awesome and amazing and just a joy to be with always. One of the things about you that has really stood out is how playful and how sweet and how kind you've been throughout the years and how artistic. It's been such a joy to watch you grow, to watch you go to Montessori school and to do so well in all your studies. And you're a really good student. You're so bright and so intelligent and thoughtful in so many ways. You're just a very well-rounded person. Um, and that is gonna really help you in your life. You're gonna be able to take that and uh, do a lot with that being well-rounded. That means you'll be able to go do a lot of different things and feel really comfortable and be able to fit in in certain places and you'll be able to be successful when you try different things in your life, which is just a, a great thing and a great testament to you and what an extraordinary young person you are. You're so athletic. It's been fun to watch you on all the sporting teams, especially soccer. You've really come along and you've, you know, with the Lion Pride, just been an integral part of so many winning games and uh, with your great defense, just able to shut opponents down and patrol in the backfield like the Woodmore Panther. It's been awesome to watch you so much. Um, one of the things, too, about you is you're so good with animals. Ever since you've been a young girl, you know, really young, you've always shown, like, this ability to connect with animals and really sweet and really kind. And um, because of you, you were so encouraging for us to get cats, and now we have cats in the house which we really enjoy. And they're running around right now, jumping, um, being kind of crazy. Um, so I want you to know that you are ready for the next phase, right? You've reached 13 years old. You're now a teenager. These next four or five, six years are gonna really set you up for adulthood. But I want you to know that you really have so many of the fundamental pieces that you need for success in this life. You're on your way in such a positive way. Um, you're good with people, you're smart, you're intuitive, incredibly intuitive and insightful into the emotional world. Um, you're easygoing, you're easy to be with. You know, you've got a good solid set of friends that really adore you. Uh, those qualities and traits are gonna help you as you grow, you know, through your teenage years and into adulthood. So keep doing exactly what you're doing. Stay positive. That is one of the keys. There's so much negativity in the world but there's also a lot of positivity in the world. And if you can choose to always stay positive with situations, you know, you never know what kind of um, thing a person is going through. So when you meet people and when you're dealing with difficult people, just remember that they're probably suffering. Try not to take their negativity personally at all. You know, stay on your own path, stay positive. Try to avoid uh, negativity. Avoid the temptation to use anger. You know, people, when they get under our skin and they get under our nerves, we want to lash out at them and we want to hurt them. But when we do that, we're really just hurting ourselves. So try to be one of the positive people in life that stays really positive and avoids negativity and using anger to hurt others. Con continue to treat other people with respect like you do. The more that we treat others with respect, it's really a sign of how much we respect ourselves and how much we love ourselves. And... These are things that you already know, but I want you to keep using these wonderful tools that you have as you move through life. The world needs people like you, positive, bright, enlightened, compassionate people. The world needs people like you. And as you see, people are gonna to gravitate towards you because they love positivity and they love balanced, calm, you know, souls uh, that are comfortable in their own skin. So keep being that way and you'll see that, you know, people will gravitate and, you know, animals will gravitate into you because they love that energy. Keep your spiritual practice, even if it's a small practice, a small daily practice of some kind, 
you know, meditation or lighting the candle or just some words of affirmation, you know, look at yourself in the mirror and, you know, remind yourself how wonderful you are. When you wake up in the morning, hold your heart and really contemplate what a good person you are and have a lot of love for yourself. And that love that you have for yourself will then carry you throughout the day. And you'll be more passionate, compassionate, and more patient with other people. Um, most importantly, know, honey, that you are surrounded by love. So many people love and adore you. Your mom and me, your grandparents, your brothers, your, your friends, um, your animals. Like so many people around you uh, love you. Your teachers, people that you come in contact with. You know, so many people when they get to know Willa Berry, they are really made to be better people because of you and, and what a wonderful soul you are and uh, what great energy you have. So keep moving through life with love, lots of love all the time, not only for other people, but most importantly for yourself. And uh, I'm excited to see the next chapters of where you're going to go. I'm so excited to see where you're going to go in your life as you become, you know, a teenager and then you become a young adult, you know, there's a whole world really is at your footsteps, you know, um, there's going to be so much that you can do and so much that you can see and explore. And I hope for you that you really use this chance, this one life that you have to go see the world and to go explore places and to go be uh, with people and to go try new things and to learn, constantly be learning. You know, that is one of the greatest gifts we have. We have one life and, you know, use it wisely. Do things that you enjoy that make you happy. You know, keep working hard like you do and you're going to go wonderful places. So I cannot wait to see where you're going to go. I can't wait when you're 18 years old, hopefully to make another video like this for you. And um, I love you very much, honey. I am so grateful to be your dad. And uh, when I had you... I totally hit the jackpot. I can't even believe how lucky I got to have such a wonderful child like you. All right, so happy birthday. You're 13 years old. Go do wonderful things. Keep doing what you're doing and enjoy your special day. You deserve it, my love. Take care. Bye. I love you. Bye-bye.